What some studies have shown is that there are certain parts of the brain that are activated during the prodrome that are responsible for these symptoms. So the hypothalamus, which is kind of this big control area of the brain that's involved in a lot of other functions like your sleep-wake cycle, lots of hormone um, production and regulation, um, typically are activated very early on in a migraine prodrome or in a migraine phase. Um, and when the hypothalamus is activated, that one in particular tends to cause a lot of these symptoms that feel a little, you know, odd, like the yawning, the frequent urination. Um, some people will have more like nausea or their sleep may be disrupted before their headaches or their cravings or food changes. They may be really thirsty. Um, there are a number of other areas of the brain that are activated during the prodrome that we think relate to some of these other symptoms like the insular cortex, um, the limbic system, which tends to control the mood kind of aspect of this. So, Kind of the way I describe it to patients is like, depending upon which part of the brain is active at that time, you may have these symptoms that reflect that. But the hypothalamus seems to be the big key player in a lot of the prodromal symptoms.